What's up guys, welcome to Visible Jiu Jitsu. We've got David Mosaga, we've got Wukash back. Baseball bat choke, suicide choke. Okay, we did the no gi version. If you want to see that, that's up in the corner. Go watch, come back. I always considered the no gi variation a variation of this choke with the gi. Okay, it's just a baseball bat choke, but done from a, a bad position. That's why they call it the suicide choke, because it's suicide to give away the position. But if you watch, I'm going to butcher his name, uh, Majid Hage, Hage from Gracie Baha. He's done this in competition to loads of people, put loads of people to sleep. And there's videos of people jumping into people's backs with this choke on and still getting put to sleep. So this is what's going to happen. I'm going to start in some open guard. I'm going to take my grips. I'm going to let him pass. And there's my choke, okay? And even if he climbs to my back, he keeps trying to take my back. The choke is just going to come on tight. Okay. The more we wind, the more the choke comes on. Okay. So the choke is just a baseball bat grip. Okay. Palm up, palm down. Just like we hold a baseball bat. So my hand on one side goes in thumb up, and my hand on the other side goes in palm up. Okay. Come on. And we can start this from many, many positions, standing, and we can fall down. We can start it from here. So. Palm down, palm up. And then I just give away position. And I keep my elbows together and my forearms go together, okay? I have to keep my hands in. Last thing I want to do, as we talked about in the previous video, is extend my arms and then he jumps into an arm bar. And I look stupid, okay? So, let's just switch sides. So, thumb in, palm in, and then I pull in. And now I let him pass, and he thinks, oh great, we can pass. Okay, he's already done. From here, I'm pulling in, and I'm bringing my elbow together. And this elbow drives up, this elbow drives down. The only hope he has to escape this is to go back to where he was. Go back to guard, and unwind the choke. Okay, so it's the, the act of letting him pass that's going to put the choke on, okay? Let's just come back a little bit. So right now, he's right in front of me, there's no choke, okay? As he goes to pass, or I move, my arms wind together, and that's where we put the choke on, and I keep turning. And that's where people get greedy, and they think, well, I can take the back, there's, there's no choke from the back. Taking the back won't save you if you have a good grip, okay? Now, I want to get the sharp part of my forearms right in the side of his neck, so I've got to take good grips, okay? I don't want to be gripping, just posture up, I don't want to be gripping like here, okay? There's nothing to get. I want to go right deep past, I want to find that label at the back and that label so that now my wrists are in his neck. Okay, we do this right, it's a very powerful choke, we keep the elbows down, it's very difficult to counter. Okay, keep spinning, keep turning underneath them. All right? If you like the video, like the video, share with all your friends, come back to see some more. If you want your own custom video, go on Patreon, um, you can request anything you like there, and all the proceeds go back into making cool videos for you guys. So, we'll see you again.